Pro tip number one: Cover your syllabus fully. See, uh, in gate examination, <clears throat> you will find uh, one marks uh, conceptual questions, uh, which you will mark like you don't need to solve anything. It will be conceptual. If you know the concept, you will just mark it. It's as simple as that. Full marks for that. But <clears throat> it will come from any topic, from any subject. So you have to cover your syllabus fully, right? To score, if you want, if you are targeting a very good rank, you have to fully complete your syllabus. Second pro tip is like while you are uh, solving the test series, and if you are not performing well, just don't get disheartened, because <clears throat> in my opinion, there is no proper test series for chemical engineering in India. So. If you perform, if you underperform, don't take pressure. Just reread, practice, and keep identifying your weak areas and keep patching them. This is the thing. Third pro tip: practice previous year questions like hell. <clears throat> it should be on your tips. You have to keep revise them regularly. Previous year questions <clears throat> are the most important part of your preparation. Because gate has a nasty habit of repeating the previous equations, uh, like you can identify it yourself. That sometimes they don't even change the question, not even the uh, the options which they are giving. So <clears throat> it will give you like a very good boost if you have previous equations on your tips. It will just improve your rank very well. So practice previous year questions very well. Problem number four. <clears throat> See, in gate, they provide you their own calculator, which will be embedded <clears throat> in the interface, and uh, that calculator is different <clears throat> from what we are used to use, right? So what you do is go to Play Store, download any gate calculator app, and start using it from today. Whatever calculation you are doing, whatever while preparing, just start using it. <clears throat> just don't lie to yourself that you will start using it tomorrow or you will do it during the examination. No, you have to force yourself to use that from today. And uh, the reason why I'm like imposing this on you <clears throat> is that because you can save not seconds, minutes if you are efficiently using the calculator. There are many functions in that and you have to be like well versed with those functions. So for that, start using it from today in your daily life until your gate examination and you will do it. And finally, pro tip number five, keep revising. Now, I can summarize whatever I told you in the whole video as the following. <clears throat> First, study according to the syllabus. Download the syllabus from the GATE 2020 website and study according to it. Second, study through some reliable coaching institute's notes and then hop to books and NPTEL videos for the topics which you are unable to understand from the notes. Third, solve previous year subjective questions, that is the questions before year 2000. Identify your weak points or the areas which you didn't study during your reading phase and then <clears throat> fix them, patch them. Fourth, solve the previous year objective questions, that is the questions from year 2000 to 2012 only. And don't forget to identify the weak points. Again study, again fix the weak points for the objective questions which you just studied. Fifth, start solving other resources. You can use Mr. Ram Prasad's book or you can use the test series. Sixth, start giving full length tests during the slot on which you are having your original gate examination. You can use test series and you have to use the questions from year 2013 to 2019. Use them as a full length test and assess your performance and rate yourself that if you were going to take the exam in that year, how much you have scored, how much rank you might have secured. 
and keep improving on that basis and in the end stay calm and keep revising